I had an interesting Valentine's Day. My girlfriend got mad at me. Yeah, because I, I follow some, uh, some blonde girl with big tits down 3rd Avenue every day. <laughs> I don't understand. My girl, though, she's a water sign. Well, I don't know how you say it, a squirter. But... <laughs> I'm an air sign. I'm an air sign. There used to be a lot of us, but then the fire signs attacked. And... Uh, this crowd is fucking old. <laughs> Didn't get that, you're old. I don't know. I've dated a lot of women in my day. I used to... Alright, this is something interesting that I did uh, this week. I, I had sex with a pocket pussy. For the first time. I know as a guy, you're not supposed to say that, right? You're supposed to say she was a five foot one Puerto Rican or whatever. I don't know. I don't know what you're supposed to say, okay? But I love, I love dating Latina women. Really, I do. Hispanic women, I love it, okay? One time I dated this Mexican girl for three months, and then she broke my heart, and now she's my Latinx. But that was silly. Some of these are new, I apologize. I just, I like, I like women with accents. That's a thing for me. Do we, do you find that sexy? Like somebody with an accent? I have an accent. You have an accent? What's your accent? I'm a Latina. You're a Latina? <laughs> <laughs> You're a dark Latina. <laughs> hey, let's, listen, look at my skin. I can say that. That's interesting. Okay, you, so you, what, what country? Dominican. Demi oh wow, exactly what I said too. How tall are you? You five one? This is the girl that I <laughs> Well you can use that. You can no, you said Puerto Rican. Oh I did? You did. Oh I, I wrote Dominican in my uh, notes. <laughs> Your people are the same to me. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. Listen, I don't know the difference, but I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm like any girl with an accent, really. Any accent from anywhere. Like one time I was with this girl, she had such a thick accent. I was like, oh my god, that is so sexy. Where's that accent from? And she's like, it's a stutter. And I was like, oh, okay. I was like, I'm gonna come. She's like, cook, 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 come at my tits. And I did, of course, you know, can't disrespect the disabled. But, good, you guys like me enough. Now we can do some fun jokes. <laughs> One of my best friends is trans. I'm like 95% sure, okay? And before we go into this bit, just know that I, I support trans women, okay? I believe trans women are women as long as they're skinny. That's what I always say. <laughs> and like, obviously that's a joke, but that like makes me laugh, the idea of somebody who's like cool with trans people, but they're still sexist. You know, like someone who's like, trans women are women, and they them belong in the kitchen. <laughs> like, that makes me laugh. But basically, the reason I bring this up is uh, I, I wrote some trans jokes, and I, I wanted to tell it to my friend to see, like, if she found it offensive, okay? And so, the joke that I wrote was, how can you tell if a trans woman is rich or poor? And she goes, how? And I'm like, well, you know, whether she has a penis or vagina because she can afford the surgery. And she goes, actually, I don't find that funny because my insurance paid for my surgery. <laughs> and I had never hated her until right then, dude. Her insurance paid for that. Do you understand? I don't have dental on my insurance. <laughs> I can't get a cavity filled. This bitch got a cavity made. <laughs> Okay, because she's a construction worker. And, you know, they have good plans. And I know this is crazy, but she's a construction worker at a site where they only hire trans women. Yeah, apparently it's because they're as strong as men, but you can pay them as little as women. <laughs> we did good. We did good. Do you know how hard I had to work for liberal people to love those jokes? <laughs> day in and day out, okay? Being a comedian is the hardest job in the world. I don't know. I, I try to support women. I do. I, uh, I don't know. This is my opinion. I think we should hire more women. I really do. I think, because this is why. Because women can do anything that a man can do for less money. <laughs> I wrote that yesterday. <laughs> That's a good point, though, right? It's not funny yet, but we'll move on. I have a, I have a, I have a younger brother. 
he's in high school, and uh, you know, I thought when I was like in that like that age, like that I was smart, but this kid is just. Because he's in AP U.S. History, and he called me on the phone the other day, and he was like, "Why? you know what I found out in history class? And I'm like, what? He's like, did you know Obama was the only black president in U.S. history? I was like, who did you think was a black president? This man said Alexander Hamilton. Because <laughs> I, remember, I remember when I was his age, right? right? Like, okay, middle school. I remember when I was in middle school. Okay, I used to get random erections almost every single day. <laughs> yes, and that's why I quit substitute teaching. But, <laughs> but I remember when I was actually in middle school, like as a child, right? I fucking won you back. Uh, <laughs> don't ever let up. Don't, I laugh every time I pause. Uh, <laughs> I remember when I was in middle school, man, I went to an interesting school because they, you know, they were, they were all white kids and it was a Catholic school. So they would say no bad words but they would say every racial slur. It was wild, I'd be like, fuck you. They're like, don't say the F word, you curry man. I was like, that was way worse. I was like, I'm gonna tell the principal, bitch. He's like, you better not you chicken tea on the side. I'm like, are these all foods? <sighs> but no, no, my brother and his generation, they have problems that like, I didn't have in school. I remember, because my brother told me that nowadays they have school shooting drills. They have active shooter drills in school. I was like, what the fuck are they teaching you at Sandy Hook, dude? <laughs> this is my take. This is my take on school shootings, okay? This is my take. You guys went with me for trans people, so this will be easier. <laughs> Here's my take, okay? I don't, I don't want to blame any group of people for school shootings, okay? But it, it seems like it's a lot of White people, okay? And the only reason I say that is I've been talking to my black friends and they're all like, how about we segregate schools again? Because it would be safer. How about, how about separate but not lethal? Does that sound good? 